All right, crunch time on the jump. FIBA World Cup is in China this September, and Woj and the New York Times are reporting the Team USA roster will include Anthony Davis, James Harden, Damian Lillard, among others, and that Zion Williamson will have a shot to make the team. Vince, what did playing for Team USA mean to you? It's it's nothing like it. Obviously, you play in the NBA and you reach that goal, but when you're representing your country, having the opportunity to play for gold and and, and accomplish that goal, and with you just can't beat that. All the all stars yeah. there. I mean, and it's, it's kind of fun to be playing. You look with at it. Everyone. You know, you always talk about the the super teams that we've seen that didn't work. Mm -hmm. And then you look at the Olympic, the Olympic team, Dream teams, yeah. you make it happen, yep. and they find a way to get it done. I except for Greece, but we won't talk about that. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. Yesterday, Stephen Smith said that Kyrie Irving is more likely to go to the Nets than the Knicks this summer. Now Danny Ainge said he's heard no word from Kyrie or his camp that Kyrie doesn't want to return to Boston. I'm going to say that a little bit more slowly. So Kyrie has not told him <clears throat> that he doesn't not want to stay. Apparently, I don't know if Kyrie has also not told him that Spain is, I mean, you know what I mean? Like there's all kinds of things that Kyrie has not, <laughs> not told, told you. Right? Age. Um, but Zach, what do you think? Do you think he prefers Boston? Do you go with the Stephen A report that he prefers the Nets over the Knicks? What do you think? I mean, I got to go with Stephen A. That's my guy. I mean, I know a, a lot of stuff that he says, I, I definitely can contest to and, and, and get the true story behind it. I got to go with him. I mean, he's from that area. Yep. You know, they're building something Both good. Stephen A. and Kyrie are from that area. And, and, they're, and they're building something in uh, Brooklyn, yep. so I think that'd be a good look. And Wait. Jimmy might be right behind him. <laughs> I think uh, at the end of the day, it's going to all play out after the after the draft and see, yeah, we'll wh who, see does who does what, what and what makes sense for him. July 1st is going to be juicy. It's less than three weeks away. Let's talk about what's tonight, though. Kyle Lowry has had some tough games with that injured thumb, although he's impacted the game a lot. I want to keep saying that, except on the score sheet. Which Kyle Lowry do you guys expect tonight? Because he told our Tim Bontemps that he expects to be more aggressive. That's what I expect to see, playoff. Uh, I mean, aggressive Kyle. I, I think if I'm the Toronto Raptors coach, I'm featuring him in the first couple of minutes to get him going because he is very important to, to their success, particularly in game three, because of the absence of potentially Klay Thompson. Eastern Conference Finals. Kyle, uh, on the road, mm -hmm. Kyle Lowry was their best player. Yeah. On the Unreal. road, he was their best player. So he 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 doesn't he doesn't shy away from playing on the road. I may love to pressure on pressure on the road. Mm -hmm. I think Kyle Lowry would do the same thing. One of the most favorite NBA sayings of all time came oh. from that man. While we're talking about what we'll see tonight, the Raptors did something very unusual, guys. As the Warriors players kept falling to injury and Steph Curry was the most dangerous guy on the court, they decided. Let's throw out the little middle school defense. They're going to do the box and one on six plays, all coming in the final five minutes of the game. The Warriors did not score a single point when they had this setup. They went 0-4 from the field, two turnovers, and this was part of a run where Golden State didn't score a point at all for more than five minutes. Now, of course, they're expecting maybe they might see this tonight. I don't know. But what do you think, Stack? Would you use this again if you were Toronto, or do you think it was just a shock and surprise? I would. I mean, I dealt with it one time in my NBA career. Really? I had 32 points in the first half against the, uh, Dallas, oh, yeah, and they played in the boxing one yeah, in the second. It. it works. And when you have other guys that can't get their own bucket, it works. But it will not work in Golden State, okay? okay. E everybody gets off of here. Everybody shoots well here. It won't work here. And the one thing about it that uh, I think you will see it again, and now they have that in, in, in their pocket mm -hmm. for after timeout plays, mm -hmm. low clock, right. or, 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 or late game, whenever you just need to, or, you know, or after free throws, just to junk up the game for a couple of minutes, even though they're expecting it. They don't know when. Obviously, they'll be prepared yeah. for it, but yeah. now you have that in your corner when maybe Steph is rolling. Right. You, you, sh you shut him down. I mean, it was it was such a surprise. It was surprised people on the court. Steph kept calling it, what's this janky defense? It was obviously <laughs> bothering him. It bothered him sort of on a, a moral level. He felt like that should not be played in the NBA, but it also obviously bothered him. That's what we felt about when the zone, the, point, right? yeah, ago, when right? the zone came in. Yeah, when the zone came in. I think exactly. Candace Parker had a tweet up that, that, that made a lot of reverberations around Twitter about, like, what, you know, what in the eighth grade basketball is this? <laughs> <laughs> favorite it and like I, I showed him that in the locker room actually he was very happy that Candace that was, that was tweeted that, that. Um, that but, but yeah I mean obviously it's not something you would expect to see in an NBA finals game and Nick Nurse said yesterday hey I know people are making fun of me but guess what we're trying to win four games that, to win but that, that shows the ultimate right? sign of respect though that the other 100%. team has for you absolutely